YouTubers, I'm Michael Hayes and I'm going to be doing another video on how to use the time lapse feature on the GoPro Hero 5. Now I've had two videos so far, one the unboxing, another one on how to do slow motion and this one's going to be time lapse and I'm going to be doing the time lapse with the video feature rather than the individual sequence shot pictures. The difference in those is the time lapse and the video feature allows it just to create a time lapse that you can watch instantly. You can do your post production and it's already in a video rather than individual snapshots where you have to line them up in sequence and then uh, d figure out the duration of each shot and those types of things. That's the way I've always used time lapse but I really like the feature for video. Now the XF300 Canon that I'm shooting on right now, it allows you to shoot a time lapse uh, with video, which I really like that feature. It just helps handle things in post production a little bit easier. It's less files being transferred into your, uh, you know, whatever app you're using, whether it's Final Cut Pro or if you're using uh, Premiere or something like that. So um, one of the things that challenged me today to set this up is in any time lapse. The GoPro uh, camera is only going to only allow you to shoot for so long on its internal battery and then it's going to die on you probably in the midst of doing your time lapse. So you actually have to remove your door that's a waterproof door that's on the side to be able to connect your charger cable in the process of doing the time lapse. Now it felt like I was going to break it. I actually YouTubed on somebody else's channel to find out how to take that door off. I didn't actually record that aspect of it but it does come off and you need to be careful so you don't break it and the trick is also putting it back on so I'll link to the video in my comments where I saw that video that showed me so if you're wondering how to get that side door off to be able to charge while you're time lapsing that's what you need to do and so first of all I'm going to show you the little studio setup and what we're going to time lapse and then I'm going to show you uh, kind of the features in the menu on the back side of the camera I could use my phone to actually control this but rather than that I'm going to go ahead and just use the touch screen on the back so uh, let's go ahead and uh, we're going to cut off this camera I'm talking to. I'm going to show you the setup in this uh, system and then we'll actually go into the menu on the GoPro. So here we go. Okay, so here's my setup, very similar to the one for my slow motion milk drop, other than I'm using a white backdrop this time because I want a bright uh, setting. I do have my crossbar I use for backdrops, uh, attaching to those are some clamp lights. Um, I've got two additional clamp lights on some um, light stands. We're using bright white floodlights and Here's the other side. You just kind of see how my arrangement of lights is. For my subject matter, I'm going to be using some popsicles as well as a cigar, a couple candles, and a, and a clock. Um, so we'll see how that goes. And then here's my charger that I'm using to keep my uh, GoPro plugged in because it's actually going to be running for a few hours. Okay, to prevent the GoPro from hearing my voice all the time and doing things I'm talking about, I'm going to slide this down and I'm going to go to preferences. So I'm pulling down. Maybe. I want to go to preferences and I'm going to go to voice commands and I'm going to turn voice control off. And the reason I'm doing that is I used voice control in my previous video on slow motion and I don't want to keep having the camera listen to me. Every time I say GoPro, it thinks I want to give it a command. So that way I don't interrupt this video with a bunch of silliness. So I'm going to click on the video camera here. Uh, you have photo here and time lapse here. Now you have time lapse video at the top, time lapse photo, and night lapse photo. So uh, I think the night lapse photo will permit you to maybe do some, I don't know, sunset uh, time lapse, things like that, or when you're kind of in a dark area and you're doing time lapse at night. Haven't used that feature yet. I don't know if that was available on the GoPro 4. Uh, it was on my Hero 2 back in the day when I used the Hero 2. But we're going to go time lapse video instead of photo. And the interval is how often do you want it to actually capture an image? Here it's at half a second. Well, I don't want to do half a second. Um, so I want to look at the different options. I got one second, two seconds, five seconds, 10 seconds, 30 seconds. And you can keep on going to bigger intervals. I want to do my time lapse at, we'll say two seconds. I've got plenty of memory on this card so I can always speed it up and post if I need to. My resolution is at 1080. Um, I could go up to 4K. We might as well do 4K if it's going to let me do it. My field of view, I don't want to do wide. Oops, okay, there's a limitation there. So I don't want to do wide because I want to be more focused on the, the stuff inside my shot. So let's get out of 4K. Let's try to go 1080p. 
1080p is usually what I shoot anyway. I don't want to go wide. I don't want to go super view. I want to go linear because I tried that out earlier and I kind of like what the uh, camera is capturing with linear. I could also go narrow. I am at two second intervals. Let's see if that changes at all, if I can go any further out. I can go five seconds, 10 seconds. I'm kind of hoping I had a three. Like I said, I'll go ahead and go with two. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and set up the camera. I'm gonna go ahead and connect the power to it so that I don't run my battery down. And then I'm going to get everything set up because I've got to light the cigar, I've got to light the candles, and I've got to get the sucker or the, uh, the ice cream uh, popsicles in place. So I'm gonna go ahead and set that up and uh, we'll, we'll be shooting. set. We'll let this time lapse go for a while. Actually, we'll let it go for a long while. Mm -hmm. 